So I'm going to be doing something a little bit different than usual. I'm going to be trying on some Sailor Moon makeup. I'm a really big Sailor Moon fan, so even though most of the makeup isn't really stuff that I would normally wear, um, I really, really wanted to buy it. I know most people wouldn't really assume I'm a big Sailor Moon fan, just based on my usual aesthetic and how I look, but I love Sailor Moon and I thought the makeup was really cute and I just couldn't resist. But since it's mostly colors and shades that like I would normally never wear, um, I figured I would buy it and this is going to be my excuse to be able to play around with it. I didn't get everything that they had available just since it's mostly stuff that I know I'm not going to be using regularly. Um, so they had two different blushes and I got this one. It's the From the Moon blush. Uh, I got the eyeshadow palette and I got the Usagi lip shade. And then I decided to take the opportunity to also get some Sailor Moon uh, makeup brushes. They are super cute. I really like them. I found them on Etsy. I'll have to link the shop in the description because I don't remember uh, the shop name right now. So for those who aren't very familiar with me, this is more or less what I usually look like. So without further ado, here's a goth that tries Sailor Moon makeup. This isn't part of the Sailor Moon makeup, but I'm just going to put on like my regular foundation. And I'm going to use the Manic Panic White Face Powder to go over my foundation. Alright, so I figure we'll start with the eyeshadow. That's usually what I start with after all that. And all the shades are pretty different from my usual makeup. Here, I'll give you a better look at the eyeshadow shades. But I think I might as well embrace the different and I'm gonna go ahead and try the Tuxedo Rose shade, this like really pink one. <laughs> well, it's very pink. But I guess let's continue. So I think next I'm going to add some of the love shade on like the bottom of my eyes. Let's see. Next I think I'm going to add the lightest color in here, the Silver Millennium. I think I'm going to add that to like the inner corners of my eyes. I don't know if you can see it on camera very well, but I think it's looking pretty good so far. I think I'm going to go ahead and do this shade next, just kind of on like the outside of my eyes. I don't know that these shades look that different from each other, but we're just going to continue. I feel like they just look like gold shimmers. I don't normally use blush unless you count like the black eyeshadow that I normally use for contour. So we'll see how this goes. I don't know how to do like more conventional makeup. I almost feel bad using the blush because it has like Luna printed in it and it's really cute. Here, I'll show you guys. Well, I have to do it, so. You know, I don't think it's looking that bad. I'm looking pretty pastel goth, though. I don't know how to be frugal with blush. It always ends up being huge. Well, that might be good for the blush part, I think. Okay, next, I think I need to add a little bit more of my other makeup just for a little bit of dimension. Like we'll add a little bit of black over in here just for some shading. Oh, that was more black than I had intended. I don't know how to like not incorporate black into my makeup. Oh, 
Okay, that wasn't so bad, I think. Need to add some eyeliner now. I'm going to try to go light on the eyeliner. I said I was going to do light eyeliner, but I'm doing that thing where you keep messing up and then you have to keep making it bigger. Okay, now to try and get the other eye to be equal. The hardest part. Well, I think that's pretty good for eyeliner. We'll go ahead and add some mascara. I love how cute the lid is on this. Oh boy, I really don't know about pink lipstick on me. I feel like this is already so much pink. I don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> It's very different from my usual. I kind of feel like one of those kids that like plays with makeup that they're not supposed to and then it doesn't look right. That's what I feel like. <laughs> I'm glad that I at least used this video as an excuse to buy it and try out the makeup because I really wanted to. You guys also let me know what you think in the comments. Also let me know what your favorite Sailor Guardian is if you are into Sailor Moon. <laughs>